We just bought the very last thing we needed for the bike. No more money will be spent on this thing for parts. I don't know why I felt the need to sing that. Time to salvage the wiring harness. I lost one of my Torx bits. I know you're thinking, Dave, you're so organized. How could you lose anything in this garage? Your guess is as good as mine, friend. Son of a biscuit. I've been watching too much AO fishing. Great fishing channel, by the way. Check it out, link below. AO fishing, what a character. I blew a fuse, rewiring that front turn signal. I know, I know, I know. Rewiring with the live battery is super risky, but I did so good on the other side. I rolled the dice again and it caught up to me. Let's go get a fuse. I hereby proclaim, I will not spend any more money on parts for this bike. Bro, what an idiot I was. Off to get more parts. Gotta love Ohio weather. Earlier in the week, snowing. Today, it's gonna be 80. And 80 degrees means I am dying to get on that motorcycle. A few days away. Now, before I sell this bike with a good conscience, I have to test it properly, which means road trip. I'm gonna go full guinea pig and take this thing on a road trip. For a few years now, I've been wanting to do this back roads kind of scenic tour from Northeast Ohio up to Niagara Falls. So round trip will be about 500 miles or so. I think that'll be a perfect test for the Harley. Now the other option I have is to cruise down to the Columbus area. Now it's not quite as far as Niagara, but I have some family down there that I love and I'd love to see and I just don't get to see them enough. So I may cruise down there. I'm just torn. So leave in the comment section below which one you think I should do, Niagara or Columbus? When you get as intense as me, you need eyewear for every occasion. The sun, or to go full Poindexter. You got the dud! <laughs> hey, he looks just like you, Poindexter! The truth is, in my advanced age, if I want to read anything smaller than like a 48 font, I need my glasses.
back in business. Trying to find some electrical tape. Dave, your garage is so organized. How come your basement's not so organized? I know. Can't find it. Maybe I don't have any. More realistically, maybe I have four rolls buried in here somewhere and I just can't find them. Probably the case. <laughs> We did it! The bike is finally assembled. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Please leave a comment below, like, subscribe, all that stuff. Join me next time when we get this thing inspected and take it on its first test ride. Until then, y'all, peace and love.